Hi and welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to show uh, non-present device drivers in Windows XP and Windows Vista. Now we're using Windows XP here but this will work in Windows Vista as well. Now, say for argument's sake you've got an old machine and you want to do a bit of computer maintenance and clean up some of the old device drivers that aren't in use anymore by Windows XP and Vista. Well, I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So all you need to do is go start, run and in the run bar type CMD. Now you're going to need to make sure that you run this in administrator mode so you need to make sure you're holding the control button down and the shift button down on the keyboard and push enter after you've entered CMD to bring up the command prompt in administrator mode okay so from there what we need to do is change to our root directory so we need to go CD space backslash and that will change us to our root directory type CLS to clear the screen so you can see what you're doing and then from there I want to put set and then DEV MGR which is manager okay and then underscore and then show then underscore NON which is non and then present yeah like so then underscore and then devices okay and then equals one like so. So that's the command there that you need to type in and push enter. Now after that you need to type DEV MGMT dot MSC okay and this will open up our device manager. Now from there you need to go view and then show hidden devices. Now, as you can see there's a hidden device there that's not being used by Windows anymore. Now obviously there's not a lot on mine because obviously I've only just formatted this machine so there won't be a lot but if you've got an old machine that's not been formatted for some time and you've been using a lot of different devices over the time you're going to need to use this to clean up any old uh, drivers that you don't use anymore. So right, just click on that then right click and then uninstall like so and this will get rid of any old drivers that you don't want or Windows doesn't use anymore. So I'm not going to restart right now, but you should restart after you've done them all. Okay, this is just a missing drive, okay? So don't get them confused, missing ones and ones that aren't used. Okay, so I hope this has been some use to you, uh, that command. If you want to do it an easier way, I can make, you can make a quick bat file like so. I'll, I'll just quickly show you this. And it's just basically a file that says set uh, dev.bat and then you need to make sure that you've got that command that I showed you in between the two lines save it as a, a bat file, I've saved mine as this file here and if you just run that what's going to happen is it's just going to do it all for you in one fell swoop like that rather than you typing that in okay so anyway I'll put that up in my description there so you can download it if you want to use that it's pretty safe there's nothing wrong with it I know bat files are pretty dodgy to use sometimes if you don't know who to trust but Trust me, that's okay to use. It's not dodgy. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. Hope this video has been some use to you. If it has, please show your support and subscribe to my channel and rate for all my videos. Okay, and you've got any questions, leave a comment and I'll do my best to answer them for you. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.